Good evening, this is Andy here. We're gonna tonight we're gonna build a maze, an amazing ant. So what we'll do is we'll load up the editor, we'll click on editor, and we'll click on maze maker. So the maze maker, what we'll do tonight, we're just gonna build a nice maze tonight, like I've done an earlier demonstration on an older video. So tonight we're gonna build just a, a fairly nice maze. We'll just build a small dirt maze. So I'm going to turn the help off since I know how to build. So what we'll do is we'll just... I'm going to build a fairly complicated maze in this video and then what we'll do is we'll... Uh, after we build our maze I'll do another video of us actually playing it. So first I'm going to build the walls of the maze. So, and so when I'm building my maze, I'm just left-clicking to put the walls up and then right-clicking to take them down. So, what we'll do is we'll build a fairly complicated maze this time. I built kind of a very, very simple maze last time. Tonight we'll build one with a little complexity. So we'll build some rooms. Generally, like what I like to do is to put the finish line right up, right off the bat. So that's what we'll do. Let's put the finish line. We'll put it up here for. And then uh, put our goal. Just put that up there. Okay. And we'll put some walls going to it. Build some walls here. So when you want to delete an item, you just right-click it and left-click create. So So generally what I'll do is I'll build the walls first. And then after I build the walls, then I'll put the put the uh, launchers up. Okay. Okay, and got some decent little walls here, uh, different little rooms here. Coming together pretty good. Okay. This can be kind of a big room. Then what we'll do is we'll put our triggers up. So what we'll do is we'll put one trigger down here. And so what we'll do is we'll make this trigger open this area up here. And then 
and in here we'll put a trigger to uh, trigger the finish line. And now let's put some launchers and what we'll do is we'll build a hill ant versus black ant maze. So we'll, we'll start with our player ant. We'll set him here. And then we'll put uh, some hill ant launchers. We'll put a big one right here. And we'll put a small one here. And in this area we'll put big one. Just fill the room. Put a small one. Small one in there. Small one in there. And up here we'll put a big one. So it'll be a pretty tough maze. So then what else we'll do let's put a sugar bonus down in here. And let's put a bonus right there. And then, now what we'll do is we'll put some launchers that that we can activate. We'll put an allied launcher there. And we'll put a large allied launcher there. Oh no, that's not a very good spot. But to delete an item, I think what we'll do is we'll we need this allied launcher where we can actually use it. So let's put it I have an idea. We'll put a couple couple of those there. And then when we activate this our big ants will come down into here. Then what we'll do we need to put some more of our little ones. Put some little allied launchers. Give us some starting ants to start the mace. Just a few allies. complicated but oh we'll put a few guard ants up just so it's not a cakewalk We don't want to build an ant inside of a wall. Now we'll rebuild these walls. We just want to make it one wide. Okay, and then we'll put... Uh, One big ant down there. Okay, and we'll save it.
we'll call this uh, Hill versus Black. And we'll hit save. And there you have it. I've created a complicated maze. So what we'll do is we'll go out of here now.